your emotions is wrapped up in your soul and in your soul, there is the will. The will, meaning that you make a choice. Your choices comes from your soul. That's why your soul, they say your soul go to hell or your soul, you know, your soul, your soul really is who matters because your soul is in the middle. And your soul can be controlled by your spirit or by your flesh. This is your soul. This is your flesh. This is your spirit. Your spirit is who got born again. Your spirit is where you hear the voice of God. That still soft voice that's saying, don't do this or don't do that. And it speaks into your soul. Then your flesh that comes now that wants you to do those fleshy things, wants you to get upset, wants you to carry uh, 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 unforgiveness, wants you to lash out, comes and speaks also to your soul. Then the soul where the emotion is has to make a choice. Am I gonna listen to my spirit where God is speaking or am I gonna listen to my flesh? It's a choice that we have to make. And through choices, we plant seeds. Your seed can either be good or your seed can either be bad. And whichever one we decide to, 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 to choose, we decide to do, how we decide to react, how we decide to, 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 to cooperate with, with, with each other, with other people, is the fruit it's going to bear. That's why you have the fruit of the spirit and you have the fruit of the flesh. So our job, and as we go this week, we must know within ourselves where we are in this present time. Where we are this week, today is Monday, 7.25 a.m. in America time. And, and I believe we're now on the same time zone as uh, Jamaica as well. And whatever time zone that you're joining from, today is a new day. Today starts a new week ahead. Always know where you are. Because where, when you know where you are spiritually, you will be able to make the right decision. You know when this thing doesn't feel right. You know when this thing doesn't sound right. That's why the Bible said be quick to listen and not be quick to react. Because the moment we react and we do it, we do it so much. We easily react because we're so used to it. That's why we must, the Bible said, retrain yourself. Uh, 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 renew your mind. Retrain your mind. Retrain your mind. And that's why you come on this call this morning, this meeting this morning. That's why you go to church. That's why you come to Bible study, to retrain your mind, to get yourself back in tuned, to get a tune up so that you will always be in a position to hear. The moment you get yourself ready before time is the moment the enemy cannot catch you off guard. The moment you get yourself ready before time is the moment the enemy cannot catch you off guard. That's why we are to prepare ourselves. And as we are moving this Monday morning, setting our week ahead, we are preparing ourselves in the mighty name of Jesus. You will go forth this week in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And I declare that you will hear the voice of God 
with clarity in the mighty name of Jesus. As you go forth this week, you will make the right choices in the mighty name of Jesus. In your businesses, you will make 